Alright, so it's been a while since I've made a video again. So, and I I've been meaning to make a video. I was gonna, I wanted to make a video before prom, and like after prom, and then before I graduate and after I graduate. But I failed to do that, so I'm gonna do after prom, before graduating. I don't know, fill you in on some of the interesting end of the year things that have happened as mostly this is from me, because I have a bad memory, and so I like to look back and think, oh yeah, that happened. Alright, so prom went better than expected. Had fun. Mostly all I did was literally played, um, I don't know what the game was, but it was on Xbox, the Xbox One, the dancing game. Then we left at 11, we packed up, and we drove three hours to Moscato, Wisconsin, and then we stayed there for two nights. It was super, super fun. Really fun. Uh, and that also went better than I was expecting to. Um, it was me, Milan, Michael, Ivan, and Adam. Super fun. Uh, and then yeah, so last Thursday was our last band concert, and tomorrow will be our last Memorial Day Parade, or my last Memorial Day Parade, and then Tuesday we're performing at Six Flags, and then on Friday of next week we graduate. But so yeah, I don't know if you can see. This is my graduation robe. The pink cord is what we got for being in band. And then I also got a pretty nifty plaque. I'm super proud of. It says excellence, dedication, and commitment in real school 2009-2016. That was a really emotional day. Lots of crying. This band is obviously a, was a really important aspect of my life. It, you know, it brought me to friends, and even though, like, there's people in the band that I don't necessarily like, mostly were, like, a family, which is true. There are people in my family I don't like, too, so definitely were, like, a family, and it's going to be weird to not have that. And, I don't know, kind of always been like, you know, like outcast. So, band was a place that I fit in and I have friends, so it's always been important to me. And it also brought me to, like, Asia, which led to Freaks by Nature, which was also an important part of my high school career. So, yeah, band is important and I'm going to miss that. It's probably the only thing I'm going to miss about the real school. Honestly. Okay. okay, so what was the... Oof, and Isaac is going to be getting here tomorrow. I just realized he's coming in tomorrow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh! He's going to be really exciting. I haven't seen him in person in three years. Actually, a little over three years, because I've been counting by Christmases, so. And I'm really excited for that, too. It's going to be a blast. He's staying for about a month in June, and then he goes back the day after my graduation, like, party. And, yeah, that's going to be hard, too. <laughs> so I will adjust him being here, and then I'm going to have to, like, go through the re-grieving process of him leaving again. Man, like, the first time he left, like, for, um, basic training, I was, like, crying, like, months in advance. Like, I would look at him in the car and just start crying. And he'd be like, oh my god, stop. Because, <laughs> you know, we were, like, like that. So I'm excited for that. Uh, that was what I was really look looking forward to for the end of the year, was being able to see Isaac. And... 
I was also not looking forward to graduating because my dad wasn't going to be there, but as life would have it, he is actually not being deployed, so he was able to see, like, me for prom, and he was, he's going to be here for graduation, and he's not deploying, which is really awesome, because then I get to have my dad and my brother there, and, like, they're the most important people in my family that are still alive, so, because I really look up to my dad, and Isaac has obviously been my lifelong best friend, so. Oh, and yeah, at the concert, Milan surprised me and showed up. That was really fun. I was so excited when I saw her. Yeah, jumping around from topics. Mm. Ooh, oh yeah, and at the concert, one thing that was really fun was we did New York. And, like, New York, New York, Frank Sinatra. And we did, like, a dance number, and the song after that was Born to be Wild. And, like, I had a hat on, like, like this hat, actually. And I was, like, when the, when the song started, I, like, threw it down. And then it, like, took out my hair and, like, whips it around. It's fun. Good time. Good time. And then there was also, like, some time where we were doing nothing because I don't remember what was happening, but, like, somebody didn't have a mic or somebody didn't know what was happening. So we were just kind of sitting there on the stage, like, hello. And so then I did a shout out to Milano. I was like, hey. Yeah. And she's also going to be there for graduation, which is also awesome. And Megan's going to be there for graduation. I'm going to be probably a mess at graduation, too. Oof, I don't let go of things easy. So. Yeah. And, uh, basically, this is my last, like, summer to be a child. Even though technically I'm an adult because I'm 18. Oh, when I, on June 3rd is when I'm officially, like, free of the house rules, basically, like, so I'll be able to wear makeup freely and not potentially be grounded, although they've been really chill about it lately, or pants and shorts and whatever, yeah, so that's the thing. I was pretty nervous about the graduation when I was coming up to it, now that it's kind of getting close. I mean, it's still going to be emotional, but they money. <sighs> so, I think that was all I wanted to talk about. Crown, and interview stuff. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. I'll be talking to you soon. Maybe not by myself. Maybe with Isaac. Maybe we'll do another episode of Abba Week, y'all. Oh. It's been so long, so long. Alright, salty free- oh! Mm.